Cellular machine-to-machine, -machine, or M2M devices, can sometimes require unique solutions to receive and maintain a reliable cellular signal. Additionally, several things can create difficulties in cellular M2M installations. Distance from cell towers, hills, valleys, concrete and metal building materials, and even foliage can all block cellular signals. All of these issues can result in slow data speeds, data errors, or even total data loss. We Boost antennas and signal boosters are perfect for applications where M2M devices need to communicate in extreme weak signal environments. With the rapid increase of cellular M2M devices, cellular connectivity is at an all-time high. Cellular M2M devices are everywhere, which presents unique challenges. Fleet telematics, remote monitoring and control, ATMs, vending machines, and asset tracking are just a few examples. In summary, M2M devices can be virtually any application where a machine communicates via cellular signal with another machine or computer. Without reliable connectivity, these data devices can be rendered unusable. But whatever your M2M application, WeBoost has a solution for you. In this example, the WeBoost Signal 4G is being used to gain optimal performance. The external antenna picks up hard-to-detect cellular signals which are amplified by the booster and then sent to your data device that is directly connected to the booster. The process is then reversed, once again giving your data device the increased power necessary to communicate with the cell tower. Fleet telematics is another application that can be made more reliable through WeBoost antennas and cellular signal boosters. As demonstrated, an external antenna can be used for greater range and effectiveness for your telematics device, allowing clearer, more efficient communication of critical information to back offices. For vehicles working in more remote areas, a signal booster can be used to greater amplify the incoming and outgoing signal to provide a more robust form of cellular communication. Remote monitoring and control can save time and money by allowing you to access and control critical off-site data through cellular networks. In some areas where cellular signals are moderate, a higher gain WeBoost antenna may be all that is needed for remote monitoring. Directional antennas are most common to direct the signal back to a cell tower. More remote areas may require a signal booster to enhance the incoming and outgoing signal and provide a stronger, reliable cellular connection. Yeah.